Well, the holidays are upon us, like a big, hulking beast of doom, crouching over a corpse of, well, something it killed and was planning to eat. Ah, the holidays. Oh, just a moment, there's something thumping at the door. Seriously, I'm not, you know, being metaphorical about the holidays, thumping on the door to eat my corpse. There's something thumping on the door. I'll be right back. And I've returned. There was... Okay, I was about to say there's nothing thumping at the door, but the door just thumped again. I'm assuming it's probably the wind or an invisible demon or something. Yeah, because there's always one of those around. It's the wind. It's freaking out the dog, though. She's all curled up and whimpering. It's kind of funny. <laughs> Does it make me a bad person? I like it when the dog gets scared. She's just a little dog. She's like a throw pillow. Why do people get dogs like that? Granted, I've learned with living with her that she's awful sweet and cute and nicer than the cats. But why would somebody look at this and call it a dog? It's like calling a tiger a cat. It's not a dog. It's a throw pillow. It's a sweet, furry throw pillow. It makes weird sounds all the time, but it's still a throw pillow. Anywho, back to my little thing about the holidays. I love Christmas. I like getting gifts, but I love giving gifts more. I know that sounds so faked and... Oh my god, Christmas is great, but like, totally, it's the giving that matters. Oh my god. No, it's not really... Not like that. I just, I like wrapping presents. I like giving presents. I like... Mostly it's the thinking about the people who are going to get them that I like. like. I wrapped up some presents for my fiancé yes, last night. and I mean, they're nothing extraordinary. A toy I made. A knife with wolves on it. God, I hope he never finds this account. He knows my other account, but, you know, sometimes you have to have a second account just for things like this. You can talk about anything without hurting someone's feelings or letting them in on a secret, you know but <laughs> it just made me happy to do it it made me happy to wrap them I can't wait till the books I ordered for everybody else gets here I love Christmas I love buying presents I love wrapping presents but unfortunately money has never been something easy to come by in my family so Christmas presents for me tend to be well cheaper. I go out of my way to try to find something that I know they will like, but it won't, you know, uh, take all the money I freaking have. But, but I found this uh, website called Strictly Discount Books, I think, dot com. Anyway, they have remainder books, which basically means it didn't sell at the store, so the store sent it back, got credit for the unsold book, and then the company puts a little black mark on the bind so they can't be, you know, shipped back again from a different place or something and they get credit for it again. Just basically says this book did not sell. Um, we paid the people for the book that did not sell and you can't do it again. It's like trying to return a bag of cans that have already been, you know, returned. But other than that, they're perfectly new, perfectly fine, 100%, you know, books. They're great. The only, you know, thing is that black mark, but you can get some great books for like $2, $3 a book. I got a fascinating one for my brother, who's uh, very, very scientific-minded. Um... I'm tempted to read it before I give it to him, but at $2, maybe I'll just buy myself another one, another copy of it. But it's a fascinating book on how sight produced the Big Bang of evolution. Because once um, animals and things uh, acquired sight, they had to change themselves to blend in with their surroundings, to uh, avoid being prey and for the predators to easily sneak up on the prey uh, how you know to get into places that are easier to hide so they would have need to evolve better limbs and such like that it's it's 
just the concept of it. I can't believe it's not something that, you know, people have thought of or heard of before. It just fascinates me. It terribly does. I, I love that sort of thing. read something interesting the other day about how your um, mind closes its eyes to listen to music. I mean, how interesting is that? Your vision actually decreases if you are actively listening to music because your mind is concentrating so hard on the music it shuts down some of the other things slightly and your vision is what it shuts down a little bit and that's just wow <laughs> we got the tree decorated I really should get up off my ass at some point in time during the day and plug it in otherwise it's just a big ornament holder instead of a Christmas tree but it requires, you know, climbing under the desk and plugging it in. And I'm too big of a person to have any sort of grace for getting down on my hands and knees and climbing under a desk. It's like watching a clothed, you know, blimp sink to the ground and explode or something. It's terrible. But I finished another toy yesterday off my orders. I've got one more to go and I need to start it probably when I'm done here I need to print off a template I usually don't use patterns or anything you just go from my mind but this is a toy a pillow of a specific object so I'm going to find the object get an image of it make it to the size I want the pillow to be print it out and use it for you know, shaping the, of the pieces of fabric I need to cut out. Because I've never been good with drawing like a straight line or... Seriously, I, I tried to draw a straight line with a ruler, it still ended up crooked. I have i don't know how I managed to get into sewing and making toys, but... I don't know. Somehow I always manage to make them look like toys when they're done, even though I've never been quite certain of, you know, their straightness and whatever. I have to ask other people, does this look straight? And they'll be, no, that's terribly crooked. And I'll, oh, man, that sucks. Maybe if I had glasses. I got an ad for a $29 pair of glasses. But it doesn't say if the exam's included or not. It does not say the exam at all. It does not mention it. But apparently I can get a pair of glasses with single, uh, with plastic lenses. For $29, the frames are worth up to $79. And considering most of my glasses have been, you know, $18 frames, that's pretty good. Something is beeping. Now that I mention it, it stopped. Well, it must not have been important then. Of course, if the house starts burning down, then I'll know I was wrong. Maybe I should try to solicit some more sales and, um, get myself another another uh, pair of glasses I need glasses badly but they're so expensive and I just cannot afford that maybe one day I'll get some glasses well this has been enough rambling for now I suppose this is Dustin Dow signing off I hope you you know enjoy listening to this or at the very least it doesn't make you want to kill yourself after locating me and killing me first. Although if that is the choice, I'd prefer you slip sleeping pills into my uh, grapefruit soda. A little easier way to go. Night all.